ass and get denied by me, Dr. Tran, because I did not want to have him as a friend. Shout out to that. Shout out to me saying the Ginyu Force in Japanese in this video, but just to be ironic, not saying it in this video after I just said that I said it in the video. Who do I take this time? I think I take Piccolo. No, I don't take Piccolo. I take Goku. I actually take the Kaioken Goku, which again, would have made more sense if I took the Tech Goku to show you guys the new cards, because chances are not very high I'm gonna pull them. I don't even know if I'm gonna pull in this event because from my actual account, I know that my pools have been complete garbage from this event, and I'd hate to do a video on this and have it just be a terrible, terrible video. I'll go ahead and do a voice now. You finally arrived, Ginyu Force. I've been waiting for you. That was a little bit. Oh, Frieza. Well, I'll get him. Hey, don't worry about it. Yeah, we'll kick some ass. Uh, duh. <laughs> I hate I hate Raccoon's voice in the Funimation dub, and I hate his voice in the Kai dub. Why? Why did they make Raccoon sound so dumb again? Like, you fix Frieza, you changed 18 for some reason, but then you came to your senses when the Xenoverse game came out. But you, I just don't get it. Why did you change Revoice? Why did you, ch why didn't you change Raccoon's voice? Is it because it's just funnier to you people at Funimation? Like, I legitimately want to know why they didn't change Rukum's voice. Like, Ocean Dub did some things really bad, like, you know, the famous Bardock being a scientist thing and all that. But I personally like, I've seen some footage of uh, Kai Rukum, and I like Kai Rukum. I actually think Team Four Star's version of Rukum sounded a lot more like the, did I say Kai Rukum? I think I did. I think that Team Four Stars version of Raccoon sounded more like the one from the Ocean Dub, which he actually sounded really, he actually sounded really cool. He sounded like a big guy who just was, a, he, he sounded like a wrestler, and I think Team Four Star really nailed that. I'm glad that they went that and they didn't go full on like dumb Raccoon, because I hate that voice. Like, I hear that in the game, and it's just ridiculous. I just don't like it, but you know, it's shit. It's just shit. I'm gonna do voices of Ginyu now in Goku's body. I had my body exchanged! Since this one happened to be a lot stronger. I know I could do better than that. Check out Jace in the corner, by the way. Shout out to Jace in the corner. This episode's all about shout outs. Fuck it. I've already I've already gone down the path. Hopefully my luck doesn't go down the uh, rhyme style pathway when I'm doing these videos. Cause as I mentioned before, I plan on giving this away at some point. Hopefully, if things go my way and I eventually start playing on my phone, but that could be a while. So just imagine how much the channel could grow—not this channel, how much these videos should grow from just you know me doing this. You know, it'd be interesting. And I messed up again. I could have had a perfect purple set right there for the next time, but I didn't do it. Like I'm watching this video as myself of myself, and I'm just like nodding my head, like, "Are you kidding me?" Shaking my head even. But uh, I do love this Goku Ginyu character. I'm glad that they finally have allowed us to have it in uh, Japan Doken, even though it's just an SR. Don't really care. I mean, would Ginyu be an SSR? I don't think so. But then again, the new one has a, um, a SSR Kurobin, uh, Yamucha, Chaozu, and you know all the like of them. And Gohan uh, has Super Saiyan too, so that's good. But this fight right here, basically, when you beat Ginyu in this little event, you fight him in the story mode as well. When you beat Ginyu in this little event, you actually get some Frieza medals. You can't get the card in any way yet, in global at all. But you get Frieza medals. It's random. You can get like three of them, two of them. I've gotten like four ones from the final boss, but that's not from Ginyu. Look at that. If I had used Cell instead of Gohan, I would have a super. Like, I'm looking at this video and I'm nodding. Why say nodding? I'm, I'm shaking my head at the fact that I'm saying nodding. I do love Kaioken Goku, though. That aura, oh, that aura is amazing. The one issue I have with Gogeta is the aura is not to what I imagine it be. When I saw Gogeta's aura, I mean, when I imagine Gogeta in this game, I imagine him having that sparkly aura of his that he had in 
the actual like movie or like maybe he didn't have it in the movie maybe i imagine that aura but basically i imagine gogeta with like a, a sparkling aura surrounding him like it's not even real aura as much as it's just like a bunch of sparkling bits around him as if like you know gary glitter came and dropped a bunch of you know confetti and glitter down around him what am i saying i don't know but i imagine gogeta with a glitter with a shiny glittery aura and it didn't pan out i think that uh raging blast did, was he in raging blast maybe i'm thinking about tenkaichi i think maybe tenkaichi 3 did it really good with uh gogeta's aura not that i remember it that well but i'm pretty sure it was good that game was really good for auras and now i'm talking about a different game while i'm watching a video of me playing this oh boy uh, i think this is the last fight though so this should be interesting I know the last video was way too long, but I want to say thank you to all the views I got. Even though I seem to get more views on the second part than I did on the first part. I think, I'm not 100% sure, but I think it's because I said there were summons in that video. and People love summoning videos. Like I think people just love the fact that they get to see people pull things that they didn't get to pull. And they get to see somebody like, man, I didn't pull that golden freezer that I wanted so much. So I'm going to watch this guy's video. And then that guy's video, you're just like, oh my god, he got golden freezer. I can't believe it. And then you go to yours, and you're like, oh man, I'm feeling good now. Because I saw him get golden freezer. And now I'm going to get golden freezer or something really good. And then you get an SR Goldo. And you're just like... I hate my life and I hate the YouTuber. I'm going to give him five thumbs down because he's a piece of crap. That's what, you know, I hope to bring that type of feeling to you and your family as you watch this video and as you watch the summon videos. This video, I don't think that I do summons in the video. But I hope that I give you that feeling. I hope you, you hate and love me at the same time in this video. I don't hope that you hate me enough to try and seek out a way to steal my account. Because that's not cool. And I don't appreciate that. Uh, that's why I hide my information up there. Look at the aura over there in the corner. Goku hadn't even shown up yet. You'd think this Ginyu Force fight is going to be a long drawn out battle, wouldn't you? It's really not. Like, look how much damage I do to these guys. This is normal, but at the same time, have you ever seen anybody do normal so slowly? Usually people who do normal would have already killed these guys in one hit. They didn't. But Goldo's just taking the hit. They're still going at it. Let's start talking about uh, not things that aren't doken. Let's do that. So Cell's image right there is so cool. I love Cell's image. I love the imagery of Cell and Frieza. It's a shame that Frieza's only SR because I just love that picture of him just, just bowing down, a regal like. It's really nice. Um, let's see what else is there to say about this. Why did I get the green? That seems dumb. I could have just put Cell at the end and then, you know, maybe got higher key or It's weird to watch things like it's weird to play at this like so weak because. I'm so used to having so much key. I think I just don't think during these videos because in my account, I got the cards that just give me so much key and the way I set them up, I just get so much key from them. And it's just like, I only need half of what the bar requires to pull off a super. And I pull off supers like, you know, like they're selling them door to door. Like it's just amazing. But in this, I just, I can't do it. I can't do it at all. I just, I don't know. But now Bertrand's almost dead. He's the fastest in the universe. I would love one day. I really doubt it's going to happen. But I would really love if there was ever an SSR Ginyu Force card set. I think that would be great. Because the problem with the Ginyu Force is... Well, for one, they're, the highest they go is SR. And there's like 10,000 R versions of them. And you'll see the Ginyu Force each and every day of your life when you play Dokkan Battle. But... The thing about the Ginyu Force is they have to be on the same team. Like, if they're not on the same team, they're garbage. They're complete and utter garbage. And then Zarbon screws up right there. I think I screw up and I blame Zarbon for it because I'm a terrible person. But the. Sorry, I'm dealing with. I don't know if you know this, but I'm trying to get comfortable in my chair. I just uh, did a thing that didn't make me so comfortable in my chair. So I'm trying to fix it. And, uh. It's not working out too good. I don't know what I did, but uh, what was I talking about? The Ginyu Force, yes, the Goku Sentai. I think that was. I think I fucked it up. Anyway, look at that. <laughs> did you see that? Like he's a block, block, block. Uh, I still get hit. But I really think there be, should be some SSR Ginyu Force. I don't think this should be like the most OP cards in the game. Don't get me wrong. There shouldn't be like. 
Gogeta strong or Cell Tech strong, but they should be really good cards because the problem with the Ginyu Force is whether or not you like the Ginyu Force, it doesn't matter. First of all, their cards are pathetic in the game, and second of all, they only really link with each other. That's the problem with the Ginyu Force cards in this game, and it makes sense. But in a way, like who has ever like played with a Ginyu Force team? I legitimately want to know who has put an all Ginyu Force team. And now in Japan, you can have an all Ginyu Force team. You could have, uh, you could have Jace, Birder, Goldo, uh, Raccoon. I almost forgot his name. And you could also add a uh, Ginyu Goku now. So you could have five people of Ginyu on your team now in Japan. And Ginyu, even the Goku body's Ginyu is uh, SR. So, I mean, that wouldn't even be that special, but I just really think that'd be cool. I mean, right now in Japan, they're doing GT, so maybe they'll give some love back to Ginyu Force later on, and they give them something better, because I think that all cards should have at least a chance. I mean, there's an SSR Chiaotzu right now. Like, I just wanted to say that again to get the fact out. Like, there is an SSR Chiaotzu in the game at this very moment. There exists an SSR Chiaotzu. There exists an SSR Krillin. At this point in Japan, they give out SSRs like they're giving out Jawbreakers in the cul-de-sac. Like right now, they have an event where you can get two SSRs just from the metal grinding and just from awakening two guys. Two major guys, Rildo and Goku GT. Spoiler, I don't know. Check out Go Goten. Check out Zarbon's kick right there, looking fine as hell. You know, because that's his thing. But, uh, you know, there's SSRs. Like, Japan gives SSRs out like it's nothing. At this point, you don't even have to try to get an SSR in that game. If you don't pull an SSR, you can work to get an SSR, which I freaking love the fact that they do that. And that's going to happen eventually in Global as well. And that's the end of that mission. I hope you enjoyed my rant on the Ginyu Force. I think that was a rant. I don't know. I don't really know. But, uh, yeah, that was the end of that. And, you know, do you want more? Do you get more? I don't fucking know. But as you see in the corner there, you can see that I'm going to get a Frieza medal. It's going to be second form Frieza, the greatest Frieza. Not really the greatest, maybe. I don't know. Got the second form Frieza. And the first form Frieza that I kicked his ass didn't drop shit because I didn't fight Frieza. I fought the Ginyu Force. I'm lying. But in this event, you do get Frieza medals from fighting Frieza. And it's funny how pathetic these fights are. Like, seriously, they're not even hard. Even on Z-Hard, they're not hard. Though, on this account, they would obviously be hard. Why do I keep talking about my other account? I just feel like I'm bragging at this point. I'm not trying to sound that way. I just really like my old account. My old account. My original, my actual account. <laughs> and this account is just kind of for fun and the only way I can do videos on YouTube for you guys. So that's it. Oh, remember when I said I didn't do a summon in this video? I am a fucking liar. I'm going to spoil it right now. I'm going to say it later on in the video, but you're not going to know about that because this is a new recording. But we do do summons in this video. That's why this video is a little bit longer. And there's no tournament this week. And we're going to just pick up our items. Got a dragon stone. You don't know how many dragons I got right now. I could have 50. I could have 2. I could have 20. I could have 17. You don't know. Chances are I have more than 17 and 5 because I got the 20 stones from the tournament. And this is where we start to do a summon. <clears throat> now, I wish that I could say, oh, pretend to be all excited when this happens. Because there's going to be a point in this video where you're going to see me play with the little thing. And uh, I may try to find a way to keep that in the best I can with the audio even messed up. Because that was hilarious. I thought it was hilarious. I don't know. But I play along. I play a little bit with the summons. Uh, in this one video, when I do a summon... I do play a little bit with the summons, I admit. So this is where I'm talking about can I get it. So I'm tapping on them to let you know these are the motherfuckers I want. That Roshi right there can go go to HIFIL because that I got so many of him in this event. That Gohan got so many of him, but I can use him. He's useful at least. Roshi has one use and it has been used up. And I'm not going to use it on Max Power Roshi either if you think that's a good use for him. That's not. I'm not doing it that way. So here's the summons. I'm going to be quiet now because I'm probably 100% sure I'm going to try and edit a way to work this up. That shit was just chilling down there. Oh, he's already super. Look at this. The electricity's already got Super Saiyan. Maybe Super Saiyan 2. I'm too, I'm too excited to pull on it.
Sorry, I was amused by him saying that. Look at them rocks. No rainbow, which means not as special as I thought it would be. But that was pretty cool. All right, let's see what we get. <clears throat> We're definitely getting an, S an SR, that's for sure. Super Saiyan 1. Super Saiyan 2. The slowness just increases the excitement and the summons. What did we get? I'm so excited right now. What did we get? Are you kidding me? <laughs> I was just talking about him. Oh, wow. No, that's not the one I was thinking about. That is Zarbon Physical. It's an SR. It's, ours is R. So that's a thing. That happened. So let's check them out. We got SR Zarbon. I mean, that's not great, but I mean, it's, it's compared to all the cards we have, it's good. So he has Elegant Blaster, causes huge damage that doesn't do anything special. Attack and defense increased by 50% when HP percent is 80% or less. That's not bad for an SR, admittedly. That's not too bad. And it's not just for any just one color, it's everybody. So that's pretty good. I don't think I would make him a leader, but <laughs> Alright, RTT, I'll take it from here. I am PRT. It's been a pleasure with you guys today talking about stuff that I had already done in a video that you didn't know existed until now. Next week next week, what am I talking about? This isn't a television show or a podcast. But next time, I hope you enjoy again, and uh, let me know what you like. Let me know if you like it. If you like it, we'll continue doing it. They still have some events of Frieza I can do. I haven't really touched because I don't play this much unless I'm doing it for you guys. So you get to. This may be the only example, despite the speed of a profile actually going from gestation of just a baby. I think I used this last time to being done in the future. So goodbye, everybody, and have a good one. Have a good one today and end it on Videl because Videl is Videl and she is the daughter of Satan. <laughs>